here on our property in city, we got a lot of green growth. We had cherries, we got plums, we had several peaches, and some kind of golden raspberry. So during the pandemic, we've been having time to can stuff. Pauline's been canning a lot of stuff, and, and we've had a lot of tomatoes. So you always find something to do, and we're gonna start working on our garage in the, in the meantime while we're supposed to stay at home. So doing in a garage with uh, the city, you'll hit a lot of, oh, different codes and different kind of covenances and different kinds of this and different kinds of that. Like I say, I tried to do a 30 by 40, which would have gave me four and a half more feet than what they allowed me. But you hit a, a thing with uh, your lot coverage. So you can only cover your lot with so much uh, I guess they would call buildings or something, your house and your garage and outbuildings and stuff like that. Uh, and they wouldn't wouldn't let us go for the 40, so we had to stick with 30 by 35 and a half, which is still better than nothing. And then we hit a 20 foot ceiling or, or roof height max. So I can't go any higher than 20 foot back here. But anyhow, so I, I hit restrictions on that. So I had to lower my trusses down a little bit. Uh, but so there's a lot of codes and stuff and you got to put in wind shear straps and all that. And so we drew up our own plans and everything and got them pretty much approved with hardly any changes except for 35 and a half foot from 40. Uh, but you just have to sit down and do a little studying and draw it up and then send it in. And the city worked with us pretty decent through this pandemic. You know, nobody's downtown, everybody's working from home. Uh, but we still got it done a pretty decent amount of time, I guess. The cost of lumber, uh, it, it just, or any building materials actually, I mean, everything is just went so crazy. Okay, well in the city, we moved in the city, so you got different aspects of life that you gotta deal with. We got an alley here on the back of our property, so we're building kind of like a six foot privacy fence to block us all out. But there's the fence post, and I got a fence along this whole side. Gonna have my own little box in the city. But that fence post right there, so I've got like 35 on this fence and just the post alone is 26 bucks. That don't include that hardware on top of the paint can there. They're six bucks a piece. That little cap to go on top is three bucks. And you got two bags of concrete that go in them at five bucks. So it, it's materials just going crazy. Uh, but that's part of life and hopefully after this pandemic things will go back down but through all my 40 years experience with building once they get the prices up there they'll lower them down just a little bit to make you feel good and that's where they'll stay so they still got 75 percent of the price jacked up and they lowered them just a little bit now you think you got a good deal <laughs> but you know we live and learn but it's uh so me being my own contractor here has saved me a lot of money but it's still kind of spindly just this well, i was going to do it myself but ran out of time and i can't handle all the heat and everything besides that i'm retired but it's so 8,500 bucks just to do the footings in a two foot concrete wall. And then they want $7,000 to level all this out, compact it, put the rebar and pour the concrete floor. And then I'll build the walls and I'm having the trusses made and they were $8,000. So, you know, everything adds up with a pretty big chunk. Uh, the roofing is about 4,000. So that just a shelf. Then you got the whole insides to go. 
but it'd be worth it to have a shop. So we'll let you go. Got to get in out of the smoke. Maybe in a couple of days, it'll all be cleared to go out. And I'll show that cross up there on top of the church, the bell, without any smoke and let you see the difference. Time's getting short. Got to go. Bye. So we'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Oh, in case you forgot, remember to subscribe. See you later. Bye.